done very quickly with you. Catherine? So it will take uh, half an hour. Chers astronautes d'un jour, vous avez vécu aujourd'hui une expérience extraordinaire, je dirais même extraterrestre, parce que vous avez connu la vraie apesanteur. Vous avez connu aussi la gravité lunaire, la gravité martienne. Vous avez aussi ressenti ce que vivent les astronautes au décollage en fusée, même de façon plus forte, à 1,8 G. Vous avez été d'excellents astronautes d'un jour qui se sont très bien comportés, tout en s'amusant comme des enfants, et ça nous a fait très plaisir. Et à très bientôt.
difficult to describe how did I feel, but it's like a complete new sensation. I don't know. This is just incredible. I like, I just like being still and like this is total peace. You don't feel wait, you don't feel nothing. Like just being totally still. This is incredible. You can't describe it. On earth you can describe it, you have to try it. I really advise you if uh, you have the chance to do this, is the best thing ever. I, lo I love this. I felt amazing, it was the best experience of my life and I hope everyone can experience what I just did today. And it was a, almost the best, best thing that ever happened to me, this was awesome. I'm absolutely 100% going to do this again in my life right now. Going up and down and was a bit scary but oh my god it was so worth it because I'm not scared I was just enjoying it it was the best experience of my life. It's a, a total different perspective of everything you don't understand what's happening and the, you have the, 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 the feet up and the, the head down you climb on my mind just blonde. I think these kids are super super happy. It's probably the best day in their life, that at least what they're telling me. And the experience of floating in zero gravity, I think it sparks their dreams. And uh, I think for the rest of their life, they will live on these moments that they lived here in space. You know what, Matthias, he was born to float and to teach the kids how to choose science. January so uh, in the very beginning they don't know exactly what they are expecting uh, they go through the different phases and when we see uh, the 30 selected ones they come here for three days they get to know each other they do uh, a lot of activities uh, to know the others to create a team together and then when they, we listen to before the, the nervousness that they have uh, before the flight and then we see uh, how they scream of uh, joy and happiness in the flight. It's, uh, it's amazing, it's perfect and we are very happy uh, with the results.